Well, hello there and welcome to a brand new 87 plus base or FIFA World Cup icon player pick pack. This is a new icon, well, new hero player pick pack, I think, that we're going to test if it's good or bad to do in Ultimate Team. For cheap and fast, reliable foot coins, check out MMOEXP. The link is down below and use the code MATHD to get 5% off all of your orders. I hope we're all ready for this, and basically we need some huge cards. I'm surprised it wasn't including icons today, but you know what? Yayo Torre, there's some big World Cup heroes, potentially. Is Nakata still good in this game at this stage? <laughs> I'm not sure if he's still good, guys. Um, What are we saying? Govu, 100%. Govu, best value. Govu. Oh, that is a good card. Four star, four star. Right, the whole chat is spamming me right now to say, Matt, go Govu. I was looking at Nakata there saying he could be really good. Wow. Right, okay. You guys know obviously a lot more about the pace and stuff there than me right now in FIFA. Uh, oh my God. I had no clue he was that expensive. What? Huh? I'm not going to lie. I don't get the price. Four star, four star. Okay, he can play striker. That might be why. I still think he should be 300k. I actually can't believe he's that price, guys. Um, okay, well, maybe these are amazing today. Out of nowhere. Well, then, here we go with pack number two. Are these still cracked? Oh, they are good. Hey, guys, I think these are better than last time. Brolin could be amazing. That card is cracked. Park T. Sung is also really, really good in this game, even at this stage, guys. I still use him in my main team. I would go Brolin, though. What's his price? Wow. Back-to-back, -back, fantastic packs. This is unreal. Th these are really good. Everyone's spamming saying Govu. Like, I can't believe how Matt doesn't think he's amazing. I think he's good, but I don't think he's that good. 600k. Collar Captavia, to be honest, is really, really resourceful in Ultimate Team. One of the most, like, utility, best utility players in this game. He is great as center mid. If you just switch in there in game, the captive is a great left back though. Former Villarreal legend. These are giving out, and he's already got a nice team. Wow, that's a nice. Wow, that's a perfect upgrade. He's actually got a great choice there to improve his team. Things you love to see. Well, then here we go. Another one. Are these truly worth it? I think they are. Guys, I still think we've not had a bad option here. Dirk Kai, I think, is the play there. Play him a centre mid. Is he? I think he can play a cam as well. What's his price on the game? Yeah, centre mid and cam. What's his price right now? Is he still 300k? Oh, he is. 325k, guys. These are worth it so far. And that's rare I say that about a new, like, big SBC. Right, pack five. He's got 159 coins left. He absolutely needs someone good more than anyone in this game because his coin balance shows it. Right, he does get Marquisio. <laughs> I'm telling you, if you have hardly any coins in FIFA, you are going to pack someone good. If your record is atrocious, you're going to pack someone good. If you've lost 10 games in a row, you're also going to pack someone great. Wow! 1.3 million! 1.3 million, man! Oh my God! Right, this guy's already opened it. Uh, what's he got? Captivia... Q or Ricardo Cavallo? There's only one choice, guys, and it's not any of these two heroes. It's got to be Captivia. Right, these are the players he wants. David Ginola, Yaya Torre, Lucio. We haven't seen any of those three players, so hopefully Pack 8 can have someone like that right now because that would be absolutely magnificent, wouldn't it? We need to see someone like that. We, we don't get Lucio often. Whenever these packs do release, we don't really get them often, do we? Go on! Oh, he's already got Govu. Tell me Govu is tradable. Well, this is a weird one. This guy just opened his player pick, apparently, and typed in on the, on the transfer market. He got Pele, but then he's hovering over Brolin. Comment down below which player do you think he got in pack number nine. I have no idea. Oh, my God, this guy has been grinding champs. Right, wow. Well, here we go, then, guys. Let's go. <laughs> he gets Berardi. <laughs> Look at this content. My God. Right, he does get a good player there in Hoffman or Mavadidi. So he goes for uh, Mavadidi, probably with that feature Team of the Week vibe as well. Let's go again. 
Right, he's going through them really quickly. His connection's a bit crazy, but let's see what we get. All yours, mate. Go on. Can he get a future star? Joel Matip or Hernandez? The less we talk about Liverpool result, guys, the better, by the way. Right, future star. No. I've not seen one future star in any weekend league rewards, like streams or videos this weekend, by the way. Right, here we go then. So pack, I think, 10 or 11. He does. Oh, Vola, probably. Vola. Here we are then, pack 12 of the day with a huge new player pick pack from the big SBC. It costs 260k to complete. We need someone who's more than that. And he does get Marquisio, which might be more than that right now. He might still be. Um, I don't know what to choose there, you know. Well then, pack 13 as Spurs just beat City. What's going on with this Premier League season? Can we now get someone fantastic? Go on. Please get someone amazing. Um, oh, JJ Kotcher is always fun in FIFA. He's always, always, always fun. But Brolin is actually cracked in game. Well, here we go then, guys. Next one is good to go, man. We are off to a good start with these, so let's continue that nice start. What are we going to get here? Go on. Probably Diego Forlan. Right, this guy's got a very nice team, but Zinedine Zidane left mid. Oh, no. Ah, God, that is the worst position change I've ever seen. <laughs> oh, no, that's not good. Anyway, that's it using Peter Kraut right mid. Let's see what we get. Come on, pack 15 of the day for someone amazing. Go on. Wow. Oh, no. <laughs> well, who the hell do you use there, guys? Who the hell do you choose there? Probably Di Natale. Probably. Well, then, next one is good to go, guys. Preferably someone absolutely wonderful in this player pick. I think he's uh, ready to go, to be fair. Let's see what he gets. Pack 16 for someone amazing. Come on. Let's go. Uh, what? <laughs> FIFA myth, guys. You can get two of the same players in one pick. The more you know. My God. Diego Forlan is lovely. Well, next one is good to go. Preferably someone from Ivory Coast or potentially, what were we saying here? Spain would be good as left back again. JJ Kotcher would be actually very nice as well. All yours, man. Go on. Please get someone great. Yeah. People are saying Landon Donovan's 280k. What? Oh, wow. Oh, God. Um... Depending on, on Marquise's price, I mean, I, I would probably go for Marquise or Mascherano. Who do you guys choose? Let me know. Here we go. Pack 19. Oh, God. That is absolutely the worst player pick pack I've seen in about three years of SBCs, man. Here we are then. Pack 21 for someone amazing from Italy. Dinatale or Marquisio would be unbelievable. Or maybe a cheeky Diego Forlan, guys. That could actually happen. A Beidi Pele. Oh, Donovan. I'd still... Oh, probably Donovan. Here we go. Clearly, we need something amazing. Go on. Oh, Govu is the play. I really don't get Govu's price, you know. A lot of people saying he's not that great in game. And I'm not, I'm not surprised... Good stats, but I don't get the price of 600k. Who pays that? Fernando Morientes. Um, true story, once played against him in real life. The slowest footballer I've ever come up against. Non-professional, professional. But man, he is like really technical. Uh, Diego Forlan. Well then, pack 24 of the day. We're probably going to get to 25. Oh my God. What is that team? <laughs> What is that team? What the hell? Nah. Are we doing a share play with Bateson right now? What the hell? That actually is unbelievable. 
That is actually unbelievable. I have not seen a team like that in a long time. That might be the best team I've seen in ages. The only thing is, I'm surprised he's not got a better player than Zidane. I don't think Zidane's amazing in this game, you know. But that team of the year, okay, what is he going to get now? He's not even going to improve his main team, guys. That team is ridiculous. Can we please see your record? Is that cool? Right, Nakata. He gets Nakata, guys. What is... Uh, there's a team again. I mean, that is actually one of the most ludicrous teams I've seen in a long time. Bro, that team is insane. Congrats on the team. Oh, his record is... Uh, yeah. Oh, no. His record is not what I thought it would be. Like, that's all. Um... Yeah. So, guys, on to our final player pick pack here of the day. We've opened 25 with this one about to be included. So, you know, I feel like no one's team is going to be as good as the last guy's. But this guy's team is pretty cool. He's got Traore there, Neymar, Butragueno in the same team. Um, but, yeah, let's go. Pack 25. Let's see if this is going to be amazing. Leave a like for more of these videos, by the way. And comment down below who you just got in your 87 plus player pick pack. He gets Nakata, not for the... Last time, probably in FIFA today. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed this big new video. Comment down below if you think this is worth it. I think it was for half of the video. Then it did deteriorate, but I still feel like you can get it done for maybe 70k. Maybe less than that. You can probably get it done for maybe two of the squads for free. It's worth it, but I don't know. I'm actually not sure if it's worth it or not today. Because half of them were great, and then half of them just needed to be better.